Hey everyone, this is Diamond, and I'm here with the one and only Movimento Dance Company with here, Mike and Monique. My first question for y'all is, how's your weekend been thus far? Even though it's only Saturday, we're going to have the lady, Monique, start. Um, well, it's been fun so far, kind of like catching up with everyone. Um, you know, New Jersey and New York are very connected in the salsa, in this like salsa scene. So it's kind of, it's still home, right? Mm -hmm. Being here in New Jersey, and that's what it's been feeling like. Um, attending the workshops and just, you know, saying hi to everyone. So it feels like we're home, essentially. Mm -hmm. So it's been great. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, just to piggyback off what she's saying, man, I feel so connected to everybody because it's like friends and family that we kind of already know. Some of our friends from dancing and performing and stuff like that. So it's great catching up and seeing everybody again and doing what we love as usual. Absolutely, but it's interesting enough because I've talked to you, Monique, and realizing that Mike here has transitioned from salsa to bachata. Oh, yeah. And that transition, so for both of you, my question <laughs> is, what has that been like? Of course, coming from a dance background, but kind of transitioning really from the salsa to bachata? Well, I don't know if I would call it a transition as far as just expanding on what he already mm -hmm. does, right? I mean, it's Latin dancing, right? Absolutely. And um, the fundamentals are very similar. Um, so it was just a matter of like, hey, let's do a bachata routine. And Mike was like, sure, let's go. Funny thing was, right, I'm probably more known to be the bachatera, but mm -hmm. Mike really put his foot in it when he did this uh, routine. So th that's that's all Mike, mm, yeah. Mike, can you expand on that? <laughs> yeah, um, we were working on some things and dealing with stuff personal life, yeah. without personal lives. And um, you know, I just took the reins and pushed through it and really worked at my research, looked up everything, listening to instruments and trying to figure out what I wanted, what I resonated with and brought it into her mm. and we worked through it. That is amazing. And so, for many people, if they could, if somebody wants to ask you, what is it like being a part of Movimiento, what can you tell them? Well, <laughs> <laughs> well, I'll say this, right? Mike is um, a unicorn. Mm. Um, you know, we were in a community that um, has gone up and down, and, you know, we see a lot of... Um, I want to say some toxicity around, um, especially when you think about the dynamic between partners. Yes. Um, but uh, working with Mike is like there's just like this mutual respect for what we each bring to the table. We are equal partners in this. I would say that Mike probably deserves more of the credit because he is the one who does all the like the back end work because I'm just lazy that way, but he <laughs> definitely wouldn't mind me like, like Mo, you know, Mo, you take care of the business too. So yes. it's very much like, you know, us both being equal partners in this and he's creative, I'm creative, and we've just put that together. I never feel like I have to take like the back seat yeah. with him. And, you know, he gives like in workshops, I, ha I heard a lot of people mention that in our workshops that, oh, Monique actually talks. <laughs> okay, okay, that's, right? hey. I mean, um, isn't that something I like, know you talk, but I, they I don't know you talk. Right, yeah. well, I do talk when I, when, you know, they're saying that like in my workshop, I actually give feedback. It's not just the leader, you know, right. teaching, right? That I also have something to, to add to the table. And Mike definitely is a unicorn in that he gives me that freedom um, to express myself as an artist as well. So it's fun, it's amazing. Absolutely, and yeah. that's just, I mean, I have to cut you off, Mike, because to say like, Understanding a, a person in a company, directing a company, it's not easy. It's not Dealing with different dynamics, different personalities, right. but to see how this union has worked yeah. seamlessly, I mean, thank you. Because, I mean, listen, it, it's, <laughs> it's not easy. So, actually, right. my question now, I kind of want to move on. And right now, we're at MDM. Yes. And we know the big thing besides shows is the socials. Mm -hmm. So, for me and for everyone here, who are you looking forward to dancing with tonight? I'm actually looking forward to dancing with people I haven't danced with before. Okay. I've been trying to catch up with oh, a lot of people some dances, um, so I've been trying to like clear the dead on that. But like, I want to see what other people have to offer from different places and stuff like that. I don't want to just dance with people that I already know. Like we we have our thing, we know we can dance and stuff. But like somebody that I haven't seen from a different state or a different country that I've never met before. Okay. And I'm gonna like steal from Mike because that was a very like diplomatic answer yeah and I'm gonna stick with that as well um, the thing I will say is that like there's been a big shift like there's like a turnover that happens in the dance community of like new people coming in yeah. and so I haven't really been guilty you know I'm guilty of like not social dancing as much as I once used to so 
getting to dance with all the the new people or like you know people who I have never hadn't had the opportunity of like interacting with the dancing with so that's something that I'm looking forward to as well to see what these what the new kids got you know see what they have to offer absolutely I mean as a new generation everything evolves and I think it's important that the instructors and directors are engaging more with the community as a whole yes. I mean here at MDN I mean already it's a Saturday but it's infectious. I mean, last night was off the chain. Yep. Tonight is going to be even larger. You guys are also performing this weekend. So right. guys, definitely check that out. We'll also have some videos of them social dancing. So also check that out. And honestly, it's great to catch up with Movimento. Love you guys. And see you guys soon. Peace.